Welcome to the Electronic Gadgets channel and today we're going to talk about the Logitech MK270 wireless combo. This is mouse and keyboard wireless for laptops for example or if you're in an environment where you would need a wireless uh, kit of mouse and keyboard this is a nice little combo here. It supports a very nice little keyboard with some special function keys at the top has a very nice mouse that actually feels right, feels good in your hand when you use it. And of course it has a very small dongle that is actually a Bluetooth adapter. So it's really nice and works extremely well. It connects almost immediately. Uh, the fact that the dongle is so small is also fun because if you actually leave it on your laptop, well you won't be afraid of uh, any problems because some of the dongles are so big that you have to remove them every time for example you put your laptop in your bag and so that's always a little annoying this one is actually so small that you can probably leave it on the laptop and not be afraid that you can lose it actually so uh, it comes in this big box it's a thirty dollar or so kit uh, so it's the MK270 if we look at, at close here MK270 so 3035 35 was with tax so uh, it's about $30 here in Canada so um, maybe $25 $30 on the web so what you get is basically this cool little mouse right here it has an on off switch so if you actually transport the mouse in your bag you can actually turn it off which is a good idea because when you put a mouse in a bag because it moves all the time it's kind of always working and or always in the on state and you've got of course this cool little keyboard with it here and if you look closely uh, this one is English be careful if you buy this kit to buy it in your native language for example in Canada we have French and English keyboards so be careful that you choose the good one um, and depending on the country where you are it's a full-length keyboard with the numeric pad on the right side that's also interesting to look at because a lot of wireless keyboards are actually uh, smaller and they actually take out that little uh, numeric keypad. The feel of the keyboard is quite good. The keys look are firm and um, actually are um, have this really nice keyboard feel. It doesn't click much though. So maybe you could hear it a little bit here but um, the feel is quite good. It's actually better most of the time than a uh, laptop keyboard. So if you buy this kit because you just can't stand your laptop keyboard anymore, then this is probably the good kit for you because this is the keyboard that will um, replace your laptop keyboard. And it's actually quite nice. The uh, keyboard also has an on off switch right here so you can actually turn it off if you want to bring along this keyboard with you somewhere. But it is a big keyboard so um, I'm not sure this is a good keyboard if you want to bring along your mouse and keyboard with you with your laptop computer for example because it's uh, pretty large. It's actually really a full fledged uh, PC keyboard here that you have that is totally wireless. It uh, comes with batteries. The uh, keyboard itself uses uh, two AA batteries. The mouse uses one AA battery and um, they seem to hold on pretty pretty good to their charge so meaning that this uh, kit probably uses very very low power. Uh, it's been used for uh, at least two to three hours a day for the past month and the batteries are still uh, A1 so um, seems to have low power consumption but don't forget to uh, turn off the uh, keyboard and mouse if you ever want to uh, you know bring them along with you uh, apart from that it's a standard keyboard it has the hinges here to actually make it at an angle and so it's very simple connect Stability with this keyboard is actually very simple, uh, no asshole at all. I just plugged in the little dongle that came with in my computer and as soon as Windows detected the keyboard and installed it, the mouse and the keyboard both worked without 
really doing nothing. You just have to turn it, turn them on, and they're they're connected. Um, the mouse and the keyboard use Bluetooth, so the adapter that comes with it is actually a little Bluetooth adapter. So um, that's an interesting feature, and because of that, also it actually tends to work quite well. For the distance that you make uh, of the Logitech, you can actually, um, you know, I can be across the room and it's still going to connect and work with the mouse and the keyboard. So it's pretty good for that also. If you're looking for something because you're uh, always moving around and sometimes you're at a certain distance. Uh, the only little drawback that I've seen is when you plug the dongle in the back of a big full metallic PC tower. Uh, I did notice that the range is much smaller so if you're on a tower uh, then the uh, probably because of the big metal casing around your computer it does reduce the range a lot but on a laptop computer it's amazing the distance um, I've actually did a test and I was able to actually use the mouse even in another, another room um, using my uh, little laptop computer which is here basically I'm using this as a uh, keyboard and a mouse for this uh, laptop that I actually took the screen off and plugged into my regular screen so I'm using it basically a little bit like a uh, regular PC so I needed a uh, keyboard and mouse and I actually enjoy this a lot it does work really well and uh, it's a no hassle install that's always what you want um, you know forget these keyboards where you have to actually press a little button that uh, on your mouse or your keyboard or on the dongle to actually connect this thing is works right out of the box just put the batteries turn them on and it works so it's the MK270 wireless combo and uh, for about 30-35 bucks you uh, have actually a nice little keyboard and a cool little mouse form factor of the mouse is quite good also in the hand I actually like this mouse a lot it's a little small but it's actually perfect I find it personally perfect the batteries are included in the box uh, one drawback maybe I've noticed that Logitech has been moving away from Duracell batteries and been putting um, alkaline uh, no name or weird brand alkaline batteries and this is the case with this Logitech the batteries that came with my Logitech are actually a uh, weird brand here and so um, that's not that's okay you know the batteries are included you can't really um, say bad things about it because a lot a lot of stuff actually don't include batteries but the fact that they aren't Duracell is kind of um, you know letting me know that maybe we're slowly getting away from batteries and one day we'll we'll have uh, you know wireless batteries and mouse and you'll have to buy your own batteries uh, but you know it, it's been working for a month and even though they are weird brand batteries uh, it does seem to work well so uh, if you enjoy our reviews hopefully you will find that they are uh, interesting and useful to you if you have uh, comments questions maybe um, a review of something that's uh, not too expensive you'd like us to make let us know we'll try to put that online and uh, if you enjoy our reviews, well, why not subscribe to our channel? We try to put uh, reviews of uh, all sorts of electronic gadgets, uh, usually $30 or less, but uh, sometimes we'll have more expensive uh, reviews, of course, of electronic gadgets. And um, by subscribing, well, you'll be informed when new videos are online. And uh, hopefully you enjoy our videos and we'll come back to the Electronic Gadgets channel. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.